News this evening, an Anderson County deputy has been arrested and charged in connection with a deadly crash back in July. The Highway Patrol says Timothy Chapman has been charged with reckless homicide in the crash that killed Joshua Martin. 7 News reporter Katie Solt is breaking down a timeline of events and what the victim's family is saying. This memorial still sits at the intersections of Highway 8 and Highway 81, where Joshua Martin lost his life in July. Highway Patrol says this all started with a deputy involved chase, and now the deputy involved with this crash is facing charges. On July 23rd, deputies got a call about a stolen vehicle around 7.45 p.m. at the 7-Eleven on Highway 8 and 81. The vehicle didn't pull over when deputies tried to stop it, and that's when the chase started. That chase ended with a fatal crash at Moore Road when a deputy hit Joshua Martin's car in the passenger side. Highway Patrol gave the case to the solicitor's office in Greenville County, and after reviewing it, they filed charges against Chapman for reckless homicide. In a statement, Joshua's family said, We are grateful to Solicitor Wilkins' office for objectively reviewing the facts in this case. We appreciate the work done by the Highway Patrol and MATE team and everyone involved in this process. County officials say that Chapman was released on a personal recognizance bond Wednesday morning. The sheriff's office says there's going to be a hearing next week to determine what Chapman's administrative leave or employment status will be. In Anderson County, Katie Solt, 7 News.